committed to building something and making a difference, then this is one of the best places you can be. And, and frankly, uh, we tell everybody who comes here that uh, the choice you make as to where to start your business and where to grow your business is the most important choice that you're going to make because where you begin has a huge amount to do with where you end up. And, you know, this is a peculiar place. I, you know, I often say about uh, my selection of doctors that I'd rather have a surgeon who had actually done you know, a few hundred operations than one who's watched a whole bunch. And so here, one of the biggest parts of what goes on here is the community has supported us. And we had, last year, 4,500 hours of one-on-one -on -one mentoring. And that's just one of the resources that we're going to make available to everybody connected with the bunker. And, and it's really exciting because this place isn't about you know, making a living, it's about making a difference. And there's a lot of ways that you can make money, but there's only a few special ways that you can come together and really make a difference. And, and that's why we're excited. Uh, it's a place for winners. You know, we didn't come here to play. This is not contrary to popular opinion, the tech tree house. This is actually a place <laughs> where we give a shit about making a difference and creating jobs and doing all of that kind of stuff. And and one of the things that we live by here is that effort trumps talent. That, you know, we may not outsmart everybody, but we know we will absolutely outwork them. And this is sort of why it's so attractive to be dealing with guys who and girls who have made you know, a commitment to the country and have done this service because they get the mission. You know, they understand that this isn't sort of an optional thing. And to be successful in a startup is tough, and you've got to love the messiness, and you've got to love the work. And, you know, here's a surprise. It doesn't get any easier. There's really no finish line. And it's not enough to show up. You know, you really have to step up and, and really put your heart into it. And, you know, one of the things that we've done in the last few months is talk about, you know, up or out. I mean, you're either moving forward or you're moving out of here because the resources aren't infinite and we're trying to build a place that keeps track of things, that's about responsibility, that's about accountability, and all of that is really, uh, you know, part of the culture here. And that's why this idea of teamwork and collaboration is also really, really critical. And, we're just seeing the way the bunker has come together and the way some of the first you know, groups have already become engaged. And I was kidding Joe, but Ride Scout is, is a huge sort of part of already of 1871. He's one of our greatest you know, boosters and supporters. And he'll be one of the first companies uh, involved in the bunker. So uh, you know, in the long run, what you build is important, but the people that you build them with turns out to be what makes the biggest difference. Um, and the stories you tell your kids and that you remember, you know, 20 years from now, the stories about all-nighters and broken code and broken pipes and long shots and last-minute Hail Marys and all of those things, that culture, that sort of excitement uh, is, is what really you take away. Those are the memories that you make and those are the memories that everybody will make here. And, and the thought that I would leave you with is we say this all the time, it's not about money, it's really not about luxury and big cars. It's about being able to come to a place every single day that you can be enthusiastic and excited about and to do work that you can be just pumped about. And so we couldn't be happier to have you here, we couldn't be happier to have the bunker and Todd here. And so thank you again for coming and we wish this the greatest success.